Now I'm gonna explain how opening this game works. What is up, Joe Crew? It is me, Joku DMD, and today I'm gonna explain to you the case ratios and rarities in OP01 English version of the One Piece card game. If you guys want to see more cards get opened and more information like this and deck profiles, there's gonna be all that stuff on this channel. So make sure to hit that subscription button. It really helps me out. Join the Joe Crew and let's learn about what's going on in set one romance dawn of the English One Piece card game. So to get started on this video, we're gonna have to go over some nomenclature. There's some names that I'm gonna be using a lot and if you listen to this video and don't know what the names are you're gonna be like joku what are you talking about shut up and you're probably gonna think that anyway because i'm gonna use the word alternate art a lot of times alternate arts are variant versions of cards that exist in the set in this set there's four different rarities that have alternate arts plus a fifth alternate alternate art of one card the different rarities that have alternate arts are leader cards rare cards super rare cards and secret rare cards. You can see what kind of card a card is down in the bottom right corner. It'll say in a little box, this has SEC that stands for secret. This has SR that stands for super rare. This has R that stands for rare. And this has a L that stands for leader. Now every SR has an alternate art, but not every rare has an alternate art. And, the, and for the secret rares, there's one card that has two different alternate arts. There's the regular alternate art. And then there's a manga version of the card, which we also know exists in set two in this set it was Shanks in the next set, it's Ace. So I'm gonna show some examples here. This is a leader card, and this is the alternate art version of the leader card. Now, if you get an alternate art version of a leader card, that means in that box, you will only have one other alternate art. It could either be an alternate art secret, an alternate art super rare, or an alternate art rare. This is a rare that also has an alternate art. Now, in a box where you see this first, that means you could also get an alternate art leader, or you could get one other secret rare, or you could get one other alternate art and one secret rare. I'll explain more about that. So here's an example of a super rare and the alternate art of the super rare. All super rares in set one have alternate art variants, not all rares in set one have alternate art variants. Here is the Shanks secret rare and the Shanks alternate art. And Shanks also has an alternate alternate art, which is the manga Shanks, which is the chase card of the set. And this card would replace a secret rare spot in a box. I think all alternate art secrets should replace secret spots in a box, but that's just my opinion. So this is uh, the manga Shanks and in a box that has a secret rare in it, this could possibly be that secret rare. And then of course my favorite card in the set, the alternate art Yamato just looks so good. I had to show it. It's my favorite card, I think ever made ever. Now I'm gonna explain how opening this game works. If you have a booster pack and you open that booster pack, that booster pack either came from a blister at Target or a store like that where it was sold as an individual thing and you have no information on the ratios that are around that. It's just ran totally random what you get. And then there are booster packs that come from booster boxes. Booster boxes come from cases. A booster box has 24 packs inside of it and a, and a booster case has 12 boxes of boosters in it. So a case essentially has 288 packs inside of it. Also, sorry if you guys hear some banging and stuff I'm having my pirate ship worked on right now. So I just wanted to make this video and get it out. So I apologize for the loud noises in the background. It's also raining, but this is important information and we need to learn it. So a booster case has 12 boxes. After my research yesterday, I opened two booster cases and I logged all the information of what I opened. And I learned that in every booster case, you have four boxes that are gonna have two alternate arts and one secret rare. There's gonna be four boxes that have one leader alternate art and one alternate art rare, super rare, or secret rare in that box also. And there will be four boxes that just have one alternate art rare, super rare, or secret rare, and one secret rare. Now, those boxes can also have their secret rare replaced by the manga shanks. So there's no way to know if you don't have the manga shanks in your box unless you open all of your boxes and there's more than, there's four or less boxes left and you haven't opened any alternate art leaders. If you open an alternate art leader box, you know that there won't be a manga shanks in that box. Other than that, manga shanks could be in any of the boxes. When you open one of the four boxes from the case that has two alternate arts and the alt and the secret rare, those alternate arts will never be the same rarity. So you'll always either get one alternate art rare and one alternate art super rare, or you're gonna get just one alternate art rare, just one alternate art uh, super rare, and then you'll get 
usually you'll get one secret rare. So in a case, you're gonna get eight secret rares. Out of those eight secret rare spots, one of those spots could be taken by the manga shanks. A case is broken into thirds. You have four boxes that are double alternate art hits with a secret rare, which will have one super rare, one rare, or one secret rare alternate art, and then one secret rare. And then you'll have four boxes that are leader alternate art boxes and those boxes will have one other alternate art in it which will either be an alternate art rare alternate art super rare or an alternate art secret rare and then you have four boxes that are just going to be one alternate art and one secret rare and that alternate art could either be uh, alternate art rare alternate art super rare or an alternate art secret rare but the secret spot also has the potential to be replaced with manga shanks. So that is how the box and case ratios work in every box. I think you also get seven super rares in some boxes. I think it could be eight potentially, but I'm pretty sure it's seven in every box. And one of those spots is taken by the alternate art super rare if you get an alternate art super rare. So in a box where you got a uh, a secret rare and an alternate art rare, you could potentially have eight super rare non-alternate arts in there. And that's how it all works. I'm a dentist. I can't end without doing a dental tooth tip. The best thing that you can use to brush your teeth is a powered toothbrush. Use it. It's like going from hand and washing clothes to washing clothes with a washing machine. Who would wash clothes by hands anymore? You wash them with a washing machine because it does so much more work for you and it gets them so much cleaner. So go out, get yourself a powered toothbrush. I recommend the Philips Sonicare uh, Protective Clean 7100. I really, really like that brush. And uh, make sure you're brushing your teeth twice a day. And don't forget to floss. Listerine Glide Ultra Flosser. I really like that one also. Thank you so much, and I'll see you next time. I love this place. I love it so much. I love everything. I love everything. I'm so happy to be here. Yatta! Thank you so much! My friend! My best friend! Oh. Zaiho! Hancock! Kaizoku! 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 Rufi! Rufi! Dofi! Oh, wait, 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 one thing! Chotomate! Chotomate!